the year 2008, the Saskatchewan film and television industry was a force to be reckoned with. Big budget films with Hollywood actors were in steady production and one hit television series after another flooded the airwaves. 1,200 full-time employees worked year-round and production rose to approximately 60 million that year. The achievements of the local industry stood as an example across Canada and there seemed nowhere to go but up. That was, at least, until 2009, when the industry began to change. The downturn of the global recession. Television series ended or were cancelled. Movie-making technologies were becoming more accessible. And big-budget films were facing opposition from a new breed of lower-budget filmmaking. In short, the model was changing. What this would mean to the future of Hollywood Saskatchewan is still very much in question. Frankly, 2009 was the toughest year uh, for pretty much all of Canada, probably America too. It was our slowest year in Saskatchewan since 2001, so we've lost a lot of people to other provinces or they've gotten a day job. But within that, there's been some great projects such as Rust, where they looked at a whole different financing model. It's a community got together and financed this film. I personally think the Canadian film industry really needs to think about how it goes about making films because we use the same production model that Hollywood uses and Hollywood has budgets in the you know hundreds of millions of dollars and a well-funded Canadian feature film might be in the five million or eight million dollar range. We can't make films the same way as Hollywood does because we don't have the money. Background. Some of the other projects, uh, Stained, a one million feature shot in Saskatoon. Sounds like it's going to be a, a great piece, probably a great festival run. We had an MOW, which I, I think the numbers were quite great on a dog named Christmas. 2010, I'm really optimistic about. It started with a bang, Bruce McDonald's hardcore logo too. Well, you know, it's never easy. I think of, no matter if a big budget, small budget, a film is a miracle that it actually happens because it's just so bizarrely complex. But I've always felt and believed that, you know, making a film is kind of an act of faith where you have to love it and you have to find somebody else that loves it as much as you do. And once you, once you get that little gang of people, you make your movie. Whether you have, you know, 50 million or, or, or 50,000 or 50 bucks, there is a way to do it. <laughs>